Budweiser. Budweiser is an American-style pale lager produced by Anheuser-Busch, currently part of the transnational corporation Anheuser-Busch and Bevdot introduced in 1876 by Carl Conrad and Company of St. Louis, Missouri. It has grown to become one of the largest selling beers in the United States, and is available in over 80 markets worldwide though, due to a trademark dispute, not necessarily under the Budweiser name. It is made with up to 30% rice in addition to hops and barley malt. Produced in various breweries around the world, Budweiser is a filtered beer available in draft and package forms. Anheuser-Busch has been involved in a trademark dispute with a European beer company, in particular the Budweiser Bud Bar Brewery of Cheske Budajovice, Czech Republic, over the trademark rights to the name Budweiser. Beer has been brewed in Cheske Budajovice, known as Budweiser in German, since it was founded by King Ottokar II of Bohemia in 1245. The name Budweiser is a derivative adjective, meaning of Budweiser. In 1876, Adolphus Busch and his friend Carl Conrad, a liquor importer, developed a Bohemian-style lager in the United States, inspired after a trip to the region. In the European Union, excluding the United Kingdom, Republic of Ireland, Sweden, Finland, and Spain, the American beer is marketed as Bud, as the Budweiser trademark name is owned solely by the Czech beer maker, Budweiser Budvar. In 2008, Anheuser-Busch had a market share in the United States of 50.9% for all beers sold. Budweiser brands account for about half of Anheuser-Busch's sales volume, a figure which has been steadily declining at minus 2% per year. Anheuser-Busch advertises the Budweiser brand heavily, expending $449 million in 2012 in the United States. This made it the most advertised beverage brand in America and accounted for a third of the company's U.S. marketing budget. The Budweiser from Bude Jovice has been called the Beer of Kings since the 16th century. Adolphus Busch adapted this slogan to the King of Beers. This history notwithstanding, Anheuser-Busch owns the trademark to these slogans in the United States. In the late 1980s, Bud Light ran an advertising campaign centered around a canine mascot, Spuds McKenzie. In 2010, the Bud Light brand paid $1 billion for a six-year licensing agreement with the NFL. Budweiser pays $20 million annually for MLB licensing rights. Budweiser has produced a number of TV advertisements, such as the Budweiser Frogs, Lizards Impersonating the Budweiser Frogs, a campaign built around the phrase What's Up? and a team of Clydesdale horses commonly known as the Budweiser Clydesdales. Budweiser also advertises extensively in motorsports, from Bernie Little's Miss Budweiser Hydroplane Boat to sponsorship of the Budweiser King Top Fuel Dragster driven by Brandon Bernstein. Anheuser-Busch has sponsored the CART Championship. It is the official beer of NHRA and it was the official beer of NASCAR from 1998 to 2007. It has sponsored motorsport events such as the Daytona Speed Weeks, Budweiser Shootout, Budweiser Duel, Budweiser Pole Award, Budweiser 500. Budweiser 400, Budweiser 300, Budweiser 250, Budweiser 200, and Carolina Pride, Budweiser 200. However, starting in 2016, the focus of AB's NASCAR sponsorship became its Bush brand. Budweiser has been sponsor of NASCAR teams such as Junior Johnson, Hendrick Motorsports, Day, and Stuart Haas Racing. Sponsor drivers include Dale Earnhardt Jr., 1999 to 2007, Casey Connie. 2008 to 2010, and Kevin Harvick, 2011 to 2015. In IndyCar, Budweiser sponsored Mario Andretti, 1983 to 1984, Bobby Rahal, 1985 to 1988, Scott Pruitt, 1989 to 1992, Roberto Guerrero, 1993, Scott Goodyear, 1994, Paul Tracy, 1995, Christian Fittipaldi, 1996 to 1997 and Richie Hearn, 1998 to 1999. Between 2003 and 2006, Budweiser was a sponsor of the BMW Williams Formula One team. Anheuser-Busch has placed Budweiser as an official partner and sponsor of Major League Soccer in Los Angeles Galaxy and was the headline sponsor of the British Basketball League in the 1990s. Anheuser-Busch has also placed Budweiser as an official sponsor of the Premier League and the presenting sponsor of FA Cup. In the early 20th century, the company commissioned a play on words song called Under the Anheuser-Busch, which was recorded by several early phonograph companies. In 2009, 
Anheuser-Busch partnered with popular Chinese video sharing site, Tudu.com for a user-generated online video contest. The contest encourages users to suggest ideas that include ants for a Bud TV spot set to run in February 2010 during the Chinese New Year. In 2010, Budweiser produced an online reality TV series, called Bud House, centered around the 2010 FIFA World Cup in South Africa following the lives of 32 international football fans, one representing each nation in the World Cup, living together in a house in South Africa. On November 5, 2012, Anheuser-Busch asked Paramount Pictures to obscure or remove the Budweiser logo from the film Flight, 2012, directed by Robert Zemeckis and starring Denzel Washington. In an advertisement titled Brewed the Hard Way that aired during Super Bowl 49, Budweiser touted itself as proudly a mackerel beer distinguishing it from smaller production craft beers. In 2016, Beer Park by Budweiser opened on the Las Vegas Strip. Over the years, Budweiser has been distributed in many sizes and containers. Until the early 1950s Budweiser was primarily distributed in three packages kegs, bottles and bottles. Cans were first introduced in 1936, which helped sales to climb. In 1955 August Bush Jr. made a strategic move to expand Budweiser's national brand and distributor presence. Along with this expansion came advances in bottling automation, new bottling materials and more efficient distribution methods. These advances brought to market many new containers and package designs. Budweiser is distributed in four large container volumes, half-barrel kegs, quarter-barrel kegs, one-sixth-barrel kegs, and beer balls. Budweiser produces a variety of cans and bottles ranging from. On August 3, 2011, Anheuser-Busch announced its 12th can design since 1936, one which emphasizes the bow tie. Packages are sometimes tailored to local customs and traditions. In St. Mary's County, Maryland, 10-ounce cans are the preferred package. The Budweiser bottle has remained relatively unchanged since its introduction in 1876. A small label is affixed to the neck of the bottle with the Budweiser Bowtie logo. The main label is red with a white box in the center, overlaid with a Budweiser logo resembling a coat of arms, with the word Budweiser below it. In attempt to re-stimulate interest in their beer after the repeal of Prohibition, Budweiser began canning their beer in 1936. This new packaging led to an increase in sales which lasted until the start of World War II in 1939. Over the years, Budweiser cans have undergone various design changes in response to market conditions and consumer tastes. Since 1936, 12 major can design changes have occurred, not including the temporary special edition designs. Budweiser cans have traditionally displayed patriotic American symbols, such as eagles in the colors red, white, and blue. In 2011, there was a branding redesign of that eliminated some of the traditional imagery. The new design was largely in response to the huge decline in sales threatening Budweiser's status as America's best-selling beer. In order to regain the domestic market share that Budweiser has lost, the company tried to update its appearance by giving the can a more contemporary look. The company hopes that the new design will offset the effects that unemployment had on its sales. Although the more modern design is intended for young male Americans, the new design was also part of an attempt to focus on the international market. Budweiser began selling its beer in Russia in 2010, and is currently expanding its operations in China. Budweiser is produced using barley malt, rice, water, hops, and yeast. It is lagered with beechwood chips in the aging vessel. While beechwood chips are used in the maturation tank, there is little to no flavor contribution from the wood, mainly because they are boiled in sodium bicarbonate baking soda, for 7 hours for the very purpose of removing any flavor from the wood. The maturation tanks that Anheuser-Busch uses are horizontal and, as such, flocculation of the yeast occurs much more quickly. Anheuser-Busch refers to this process as a secondary fermentation, with the idea being that the chips give the yeast more surface area to rest on. This is also combined with a croisoning procedure that reintroduces word into the chip tank, therefore reactivating the fermentation process. By placing the beechwood chips at the bottom of the tank, the yeast remains in suspension longer, giving it more time to reabsorb and process green beer flavors, such as acetaldehyde and diacetyl, that Anheuser-Busch believes are off flavors which detract from overall drinkability. Budweiser and Bud Light are sometimes advertised as vegan beers, in that their ingredients and conditioning do not use animal byproducts. Some may object to the inclusion of genetically engineered rice and animal products used in the brewing process. In July 2006, 
Anheuser Busch brewed a version of Budweiser with organic rice, for sale in Mexico. It has yet to extend this practice to any other countries. In addition to the regular Budweiser, Anheuser Busch brews several different beers under the Budweiser brand, including Bud Light and Bud Ice. In July 2010, Anheuser Busch launched Budweiser 66 in the United Kingdom. Budweiser Brew No. 66 has 4% alcohol by volume, and is brewed and distributed in the UK by InBev UK Limited. On May 10, 2016, Advertising Age reported that the Alcohol and Tobacco Tax and Trade Bureau had approved new Budweiser labels to be used on 12-ounce cans and bottles from May 23 until the November elections. The name Budweiser was changed to America, even though the parent company is based in Belgium, a fact which resulted in objections on Twitter. Much of the text on the packaging was replaced with patriotic American slogans, such as E Pluribus Unum and Liberty and Justice for All. Budweiser is licensed, produced and distributed in Canada by Labatt Breweries of Canada. Of the 15 Anheuser-Busch breweries outside of the United States, 14 of them are positioned in China. Budweiser is the fourth leading brand in the Chinese beer market. Thanks for watching. Don't forget like the video and don't forget to subscribe.